Hello, welcome once again. Thank you so much, Ramanji. What's the tune playing? Now, what is the tune playing? No, no. No, no. Meditation. Meditation. I was in the audio launch. So, in the audio launch, I was in the title of the RDG title. Every breath is a battle. Yeah. Thangal, the music composition in the RDG title, which was easy breathing and which was difficult in breathing. No, I think it, it is a very smooth... Ah. Uh, I mean, of course, I think the production had to go through many changes. Yeah, changes, yeah. Mr. So Blessy had to go through many changes, but um, once I come into a film, I'm always supporting that film uh. because for me, it's more than uh, it's just a it's a it's a journey, a travel with the director, with mm. the story, mm -hmm. and what it does to me emotionally, and mm. what kind of sounds I want to produce, what kind of tunes I want to add. So that takes over, and mm. I forget about everything. Yeah. So there were so many changes. Corona happened. I huh. had to travel to. Uh, Jordan. Jordan to see and shoot a music video. Yeah. It was beautiful. One of the beautiful trips there. Right. So are you taking this or either Malayalam Padamano or Tangal Kadir International Padamano ji? I for me I think it's a story. Uh. Yeah. And of course Malayalam industry is very, very sensitive and people love the, you know, things which come from here. And my father of course. You know, there's a whole a whole circle of life coming Correct. back. Correct. Um so, a story is a story, mm. and suppose you know if you see a Spanish film, you know mm. Amor Esparros or yeah. uh, City of God, you know they don't we don't see it as a foreign film. Yeah. See it as a as a film, film. Yeah. and it's an expression from the culture, okay. from the land, uh -huh. and it's an expression from the artistry of the you know people yeah. who are involved. So I'm constantly measuring: is it is it up to the mark? Okay. Can I do better? Okay. Can it be more rural or can it be more international? Can the sound be correct or is it too international? Correct. A lot of questions. Lot of that <laughs> torture me. Yeah. I'm going to torture you. Mind is a tyrant. Yeah. <laughs> when Blessy sir wanted to narrate you the po, the yeah. line and of course the RG the Murkada, and you know it's a desert and a flavor, you know. So desert and the tune and that. Yesterday Rasul was talking about it, you know. It's a desert has a tune. And Nammal Thangal da Maria and lor glance kanda. It's again a survival drama. Adilum it does certain lor glance kanda. So how was this approaching? So in this, because it's got a lot of Arab influence, I had worked with the singer called Sana Musa, and she actually kind of to audition me. She sang a lullaby, and so I recorded it, and I said that tune will be so good on this one, and it talks about a Bedouin. And uh, so we used that huh. traditional tune and arranged it on it. And then there, of course, Kerala uh, influence in it. Yeah. You know, and that's the land. Uh. Then he said, um, no, he, a kind of, there was a kind of little parallel between Majid Majidi and mm. Razwaki yeah. Majidi. So, yes. so a very similar brief to what he said, you know, when the camel is not a camel, uh. you know, it's actually an uh, angel of God leading this person to that. Mm. You know, in, you know mm. in Messenger of God. Mm. And very similarly, he, the first scene in this is that I want music from heaven here. <laughs> I said, okay, uh. how will heaven be? I don't know. <laughs> we're, all, we're all in hell anyway. <laughs> okay. So that's where the journey started. It took long time, you know, and we were all seeing through Instagram how they had hardships and everything. But yeah. when you started working, maybe music industry trends on the changes according to technology. So did you other Adimit and fix it or you also adapted along the changes? No, I think movies like this are you know, we have to make a timeless quality mm -hmm. about it. Mm -hmm. It's not about oh, there's trap music coming in and you know, dubstep coming. Yeah. It doesn't matter to the yeah. story. And um, so there's a timeless quality. 
I think most of the the, the story demands it. Yeah. So it could be seen at any point of view. Uh. I mean, any uh, period of period time. of time, even yeah. after ten years, yeah. it should have a, and that is one quality which I, you know, I keep. So we go very acoustic. We go uh, with, with with acoustic orchestra mm. and do stuff. Yeah. Mm. E, uh, even for the singers, if I jump on Alphonse and the music in Karim Shalphons, Aromale Padi Prana, oh, Yingani or Mogondo, you know, we thought. Same with Tangala Korna, even Mohit Chohan with Masakali, other Lingal Jave Delhi, and even KK has sent for Strawberry Yanke. So, entire little spark, even now coming to Sana Musa, you already worked with Jitin, the young voice. Yeah. Every day, any spark when you hear the voice, oh, this is that. I sometimes, you know, we don't intend at all. And sometimes they say, call the singer, and mm -hmm. that person knows, and another person comes in. Oh, this is interesting. Like Shakti Shri Gopal, yeah. how she came yeah. in. Yeah. She came as an architect. Yeah. And uh, some something told me her voice would be good for that song. Yeah. So we changed the key, yes. and then she could have happened. Yeah. So Jitin came in, and uh, so we had the lyrics, and I asked him to. I but why can't? Uh. He sang it, and then I said, I need uh, one more word. And I heard people say, "Enda periyone, enda you know kartave, you know in Malayalam that's a, yeah, enda kartave." <laughs> yeah, and uh, uh, so I was thinking, what would it be colloquial to say uh, in his words, in Najib's words, mm. "Periyone Rahmane yeah, Rahim," you know? You wrote so, that letter. I didn't. Draw, I mean, just jammed with it, yeah. <laughs> and uh, that actually became like a chorus. Wow. And uh, what I like is actually this this torture of uh, too many big things happening in the studio. It should be so easy uh, that brilliance happens. Okay. And uh, just like a uh, conversation. Conversation. It should not be, oh, now I'm going to write the best poetry yeah. in the world. I'm going to compose the best yeah. tune. It never happens. Mm -hmm. that. And if you struggle like that, you'll just fall sick. Oh. Even on a piano, when you touch and then suddenly you change, it's a process of constantly refining. And, and that's what I like. And then that's what I love about having somebody new, enthusiastic. Yeah, yeah. And the enthusiasm, the eyes actually inspire you to push and see what else. They're not, and I feel that they're not judging us. Yeah. And we're not judging them. Judging them. Even for a director like Blessy, uh, and even for all the other directors who are working, Tangal could brief Terimbo, you start exploring yourself, other you continue getting the detailed brief from the uh, director all through the process. And yeah, I think for the past, I mean, even from the beginning, because I've worked so much in the industry, um, some people like to work in reels, yeah. first reel, second reel. You know, I've seen people working with yeah. that. But I feel like first you find what what is the element, what is the heart of it, mm. and that you don't need to see the reel. Mm. So you watch the movie, and uh, this is the tune which comes to me. Mm. Mm. It may be good or bad. At mm. least it starts flowing. You, know? mm. you start putting some ideas, then listen to it. Oh, that sounds good, and that could be this theme. I don't, I don't even think that it's going to be. Yeah. Hero theme, villain yeah. theme, and yeah. all that stuff. What comes as inspiration from yeah. what I watch? Yeah. That uh, makes things more unusual. Mm. Because if you want to fill up the scene, you use only formula. Yeah. But uh, if it comes musically, yeah. and how pure it comes mm. from, pure mm. from the characters, yeah. that's more inspiration. So, RG is an Anganuru flavor in there. Our brief, uh, brief. I think the main, the the main tune. Mm. Da -da, da -da, da -da. That one actually came on a piano mm. uh, after I saw the movie. I just started playing stuff. Then I picked that one. I felt like that's very near to what you know, it kind of embraces, hugs you, yeah. um, where you need somebody. You yeah. know, if a person is lonely, at least destiny is hugging him. Yeah, correct. The God is hugging him. Yeah. You know, Same thing with Blessy Sir. In the last few months, we have launched a film. We have a tune. We have an inner cry. That is, we have a Marikyan poem. But an inner cry, day after day, we have written. That one brief. We have to go. You have to shock us. No, this is not what we are going to do. So, how is that? No, I think I made something because his brief was different. Huh. Then he said, "No, I want, I want like a cry." Huh. And uh, even though. It's uh, tried and tested, you know. You take a charu case and you cry. Uh, Whatever you do in that rag, you make you cry. <laughs> so, but what should he sing? Mm. And uh, so, because the character is uh, a Muslim, yeah. and I felt like oh, if when um, you know there's a Nabi mm. Yunus, mm. there's a story where he got stuck in the 
stomach of the uh, fish. Fish. And he was caught there. And the only thing which relieved him from there was this uh, prayer, which uh, we all know about that. La ilaha illanta subhanaka inni kuntu min So this, I felt like this could be. This is a prayer which opens up, you know, yeah. all the blocks in life. Yeah. You know, that's what people believe in Sufism. Yeah. So I said, okay, why don't we use that prayer for this one because he's caught. Yeah. And maybe this this is the prayer which is going to open. Open. You know, even as a spiritual connection. Yeah. <clears throat> so, uh, so I called the singer. That he came for something else. Yeah. Raja Hasan was there, yeah. and then there's files. I think he was there for something. I called for this. Uh. I don't remember. So the brief came one day before. I said, okay, let's go. Yeah. I got this, and so we jammed on it. Almost like everybody could be using it. Yeah. You know, in the car, when you feel like you're blocked. Yeah. Or, so I, not just for the movie, but even for personal, it's a meditative. You know. Mm. So, Coming to uh, instruments, I think Chinese movie which is hev- Warriors of Heaven and Earth. Are the 16 languages in there? You had used something called Eruhu, a Chinese Eru. violin. D- Dudak, right? Uh, Dudak. Armenian ra- Dudak. Yeah. Or yes. Armenian recorder. Yeah. Again, coming to some other drums. Yeah. I remember seeing your one program which you had introduced, Mirava from Kalamandalam Sajitan to Kuda, right? So, in Mirava, the international scene, like the Tangra, the Nikitoni, when I saw this program. How do you bring in these elements of in, br- the brilliant uh, in- percussion instruments to other instruments combining to your musical score? See, when I grew up, I was playing in the, the Malayalam industry, Tamil uh, industry, Kannada uh. industry, Telugu industry. And uh, because the industry worked so fast, you know, three days, scores have to be completed. Mm. Two days, songs have to be completed. Yeah. So why do we have to rush? Yeah. You know, when, when <clears throat> Western people do albums, they do for six months or two years or five yeah. years. They come up with something inspiring. Why does film music stick to this formulas? Of three to five days. Yeah, three to five days. And because of budget reasons. Okay. But the thinking can be long. You yeah. don't have to yeah. have 70 people sitting for one week. So you bring them in when you have a proper idea. So that was, I wanted to break that system. Okay. Which made people do like a factory. Yeah. <clears throat> and that's when I realized every sound, how can how the sound can expand. Yeah. You know, if, if, we, if we use a, we can do it in a mirdangam, or we can do it in a tawal, or we can do it in a drums, or we can do it in a trico. So it doesn't matter, but the the soul of that rhythm can be interpreted in other instruments. Right. So that's the whole breakthrough which happened to me. I said, what do you have to stick to? And also I had samplers. Yeah. I could try it, I could sample something and try it yeah. before, before calling somebody. Yeah. So the this freedom of, of okay. that happened with with having instruments where you can experiment before you commit yeah. and give the money. Before. And uh, that's a breakthrough, which breakthrough. not just because of me, yeah. the technology change yes. helped me. Another breakthrough you did was AI song so, with Shahul Hamid. I'm sure Paladin Chodichin down. Ipuribade Akari Chukin, Epran SP with a voice chain. But you said a right point. AI should be used for the sake of uh, betterment of humanity, right? Actually, Pakshad, I feel like. All the stuff which is delaying, you know, justice to you know, pulling up people, mm. eradicating poverty. I think we should think about using these things for that. Kim so, Shalaman's voice came in because the director strangely said, I want a folk voice. And uh. I, I could never think anybody at that point of time. <clears throat> the only folk voice I had nurtured was Bamba Bakia, yeah. uh. Shalaman Dainan. I said, oh my God. Bamba Bakia who sang a Ponyan Selvan song. Yeah. 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 He passed away after that. So my thing was, and then you start hearing Modiji's voice, mm. and then I said, "Oh, that's cool. People are putting out like, yeah. amateur stuff." I said, "Why don't we use it for this? Where yeah. <clears throat> we pay the families, yeah. we ask them acceptance. Yeah. And, you know, you, can 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 your husband sing yeah. the song?" So I asked my husband to go I'll check with them yeah. whether they would like the song to be in the voice, and the payment was paid. In fact, double the payment was paid. Very nice. I said, "This is this is a great way to use it." So yeah. I'm free of any conscience. Yeah. I read your interview in BBC. Okay. Yeah, so I just a spark which happened. I said, if we can lead the way so that people don't take advantage of these kind of things and you help somebody and legitimize the whole thing. When you have to create music, people in a Najib or a real life character. So when you have to create that music for that character, basically background score or even song. Uri Malayalam circuit little trends have you noticed and where you wanted to adapt that? Angani Narno, you wanted to just go ahead 
with the entire ex experience and innovation? I think that uh, what is the Malayalam circuit? <laughs> I mean, the trends in Malayalam movie. I have no, I've never. Uh, yeah. So for me, I think no. I think the the scope of this movie, the story is yeah. universal. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, survival, triumph of the yeah. human spirit, and uh, the reason why people are coming to me is to see how the sound can be, yeah. you know, bigger. So I I think that's where they come. That's from. A, <laughs> <nice>. <laughs> <laughs> it's my own imagination. No, but it's nice. I mean, so, just yeah. thinking, yeah. And. Uh, and no, that's it. So then I try to in interpret, and then mm. because Blasi doesn't. Uh, mm. <laughs> that's his. That's his max. Para inaale thre ano samsaari kya? Nigle thandu eru. Ana. And so, how do you understand? Okay, you work with people with less uh, words actually. <clears throat> Money, sir. Now, uh, Blasi, sir. Uh, so, how do you communicate with directors who speak only? Mm? <laughs> Kola. <laughs> No, it's just uh, first of all when they come to me, there's an expectation already. Uh, you know, it, the marriage has happened. Correct. So now it's just that how much I can and do. Yeah. The only thing was um, they had a lot of channels. They wanted to ch send it for awards uh, before, and but you know, score was score needed time. Other. Right. It's not a score where I know I, I'm thinking. Oh, I know how to do it. Uh, Whenever I think I know how to do it, I fail. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah. I think that's the thing, no? Nice Because thing. I know how to do it is what old stuff is. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how to do it, but I'm. I want to do it. Yeah. Well. It's it's when I think I um, rescore and score and feel like it. Oh, that yeah. sounds good. Because when you score, you don't understand, and then you see the whole movie. You say, no, that's not working. Uh -huh. Because sometimes you um, out of habit double the emotion. Mm. If somebody's crying, mm. you should not be crying too. Somebody's still. And you put a sad music, then you understand the pain inside. Mm. So, subliminally, how music works is all the things you learn. Sometimes, by the grace of God, you do it without knowing. Yeah. Then you start knowing. Then it's it's trauma. Trauma. <laughs> and uh, even uh, same in in this movie, Ho Hope song is comes in the end credits. Yeah. Adin duvanda angana endle. And no, I think it won't be in the end credits also. Okay. I think the you think it's a separate song. Okay. It's inspired it's by. Not inspired. It's almost like a tribute to this mm. character, yeah. and to all the people suffering, right. so that people feel hopeful. Yeah, and the uh, uh, romantic song between mm. uh, Sainu mm. and Najib, Adinda in there, no, bringing to the reality. So that song is. Uh, so I didn't know what he's gonna like. Uh. So I'd given him like four, five tunes mm. and just composed and see what he likes. I was very scared. <laughs> they're all very, you know, when people have a particular taste, they yeah. achieve so much. So I just put some stuff and went out, yeah. and I hope that he'll like something. So he picked up yeah. this this, this one. Yeah, then we build it up. Yeah, and they have malare. They have all of them. Budhi muti jo budhi muti jo. Yesterday I was hearing it. You know, the world where they have cinema shooting at it because he is a perfectionist. Yeah, you are also like that. Abo, these two combination lom healthy debates in there no. Adu veena, idu veenda. Idu rendu veena, idu veenda. I think mostly. Uh, Mm -hmm. There were certain things which he liked from the first what I did, but I wanted to change it. Uh -huh. So that's where I had to say, "Please trust me. We are we are to go this way. Okay. And uh, we want to make the movie, mm. like, lift the movie. Yeah. And for people who are watching. Yeah. So certain things I told him, and he understood. He said, yeah. yeah, okay. And one place I think he said, uh, I told him like, if you want to remove music anywhere, mm -hmm. you can. Mm -hmm. So post interval, I think he felt like. Uh, I want to remove the music here because of certain things. You'll, you'll, you know why. Mm. So we removed a whole chunk of music. <gasps> But other Vishnu will be. Thring Kashtapur. No, because the movie is more important yeah. than the music. Okay. For R D G with them people, they used to come and see this movie. In the Anavari Mansal Pradeshi Kendra. I think beyond all the all the interviews, beyond, I think it's a it's a movie worth watching mm -hmm. for the artistry, mm -hmm. for the commitment, mm -hmm. and for the wholesomeness. Yeah. I would say. Because even. Um, I'm hesitant to watch sad movies. Yeah. But I, when I watched a couple of reels after yeah. the post production, after Russell yeah. had put effects and yeah. music and everything, I think some magic had happened. Yes. And I felt like I was very pleased. I was very worried. Before. Okay.